It's okay. It's okay to have a little bit of dust on the old meat injector. It's okay to have a little bit of questionable, you know, things going on down there. You know what I mean? I'm just letting you know. I'm not trying to be your gym teacher. I'm not trying to be some guy showing you disgusting images that scar you for life. I'm not trying to be this guy who wants to talk about your boner on the internet, okay? That's not what I'm doing here. Because the reality is, it's just all a joke. So I'm not actually doing this because if we were having a conversation in real life, I would never do that. We would never be doing this. But here I am getting you to turn that junker into pure gold on wheels. Now, your boner is a race car. In a mind, it started off in a junkyard. You know what I mean? You were born in a trailer or something. You were born in a gutter. You were born in, in the park or something. You know, you were born in the back seat of a Camaro, maybe. Probably not. Probably a van. Some hippie van or something. Some cult or some some you a cult baby. Probably. Maybe. I don't know what kind of kid you are. I don't know what you were raised on. You were probably raised on pubes. I mean, I don't I have no idea. I have no idea if they're feeding you chicken pubes every day, all right? That's on you. But I'm here to restore you, you know, just like they do on all those shows that kind of became very overwhelmingly repetitive, you know, just like everything else. And then you look at me and you're like, oh, that's why he's doing what he's doing, because everything is just the same thing. And I'm over here with a new style, a new way of thinking. And a lot of people can't touch it. They can't grab it. They can't mimic it. They can't copy it. They try to rip it off. They try to do this and that. And I'm just original, you know? And we've seen it time and time again. Some original bastard comes along, you know? A bunch of people, you know, rip them off. And sometimes it happens. Sometimes it's happened successfully because the person gives up. But if someone starts ripping you off, if people start copying you, if people want to be like you, if people wonder, how the hell do you do that? Just how in the hell do you do it? Then you're probably going to be someone like me, you know? Teaching people how to turn their little junker into a pure gold specimen only their eyes can enjoy. Well, anyone can enjoy. Everyone can enjoy because you, basically your cock is going to get a new engine. We're going to change the oil. We're going to get new tires. We're going to we're going to do everything we need. Axles, bearings, you know, frame. Okay, let's just get you a new just just get you a new dick. Dick implant. But now it's gold. Press that accelerator. You feel it? It used to be some little rusty junky wagon no one cared about. We took it out of the junkyard. And it's demolition derby time. Actually, most of the relationships I see are kind of like that, you know what I mean? They're kind of these junkyard folk. And they just kind of demolition derby that dick right into that vagina. You know? Most damage wins. Bruise those pussy cheeks. Give them a black eye. Injure the Cyclops. Put the snake in the hole. The bun in the oven. Okay.